Microsoft may have had a few bad years, but this 2013 reboot developed by Crystal Dynamics may well turn her fortunes around. Presented as an origin story, Tomb Raider takes us right back to the beginning. It shows us how a young and innocent Lara gets introduced to a life of danger, violence and high adventure. As such, it is the perfect way to reintroduce gaming's number one heroine. Lara and her crew are shipwrecked after heading out to search for a legendary island, but they are not alone in the mysterious place that they find themselves. Others, members of a twisted cult, are also present, and Lara has to fight for the survival of her team and herself in an action-packed, slickly produced game. Crammed with tense cinematic moments, nail-biting traversal sections, and more action than you can shake a stick at, Tomb Raider takes a fresh look at Lara Croft. Fans may not like the idea, but in the end, it's a game that is well worth playing. Tomb Raider is a visual feast. The environments that the players get to explore are vast and complex and beautifully brought to life. So too are the various characters, with particular attention to detail going into Lara herself. Her personal progress is visual as well. She changes through the course of the game without ever compromising the core of her visual personality. The characters fit beautifully into the environment with a believable interaction between them and their surroundings. When it comes to action, Tomb Raider is full of special effects. It looks like a Michael Bay movie at times with flaming buildings, explosions and thrilling set pieces helping define the visual tone of the title. The voice acting and sound effects are also of an extremely high quality, making the overall presentation of this game superb. The player is guided skillfully through the game's difficulty curve, and the sensible control scheme will have them zip lining, climbing, jumping and fighting with ease before long. There is a lot to do in this game which doesn't center around exploring lost tombs, even though there are a number of them to explore. Instead, it offers the player a whole lot more, including crafting, finding collectibles and hunting animals. The game plays smoothly and without many bugs at all. Overall, the dynamics are not very different from any other third-person adventure title, but the systems have been tweaked really well, making Tomb Raider feel as good as it looks. My brothers, now you die. This is a very important story for Lara Croft. It's her starting point after all, and as such, provides a great groundwork for the sequels that are sure to follow. The tale is well paced and, although sometimes predictable, does hold more than a few surprises. It's pretty long too, so the player will be able to get a good deal of enjoyment out of a single playthrough. But there is so much more to do than just get through the narrative. Players will be able to revisit areas to complete goals and challenges. New equipment will also allow the player to access areas they couldn't get to before. On top of single player replayability, Tomb Raider also offers a multiplayer component. It's fun, but it's definitely the weakest aspect of the game. Tomb Raider is a massive roller coaster of challenge, tension, action and fun. Its great pace, awesome visuals and solid plot make it one of those games that come highly recommended for virtually any gamer, regardless of tastes and skill levels. It is, simply put, a game that everyone should play, and it is an excellent way to restart Ms. Croft's already rich gaming legacy.